My name is Chloe Conway and I work with the Dance for Parkinson's group. Um, so a typical class will start um, all seated in a circle. We'll generally introduce our theme um, and then we'll start with um, upper body warm-ups and we'll do um, leg warm-ups but all seated so that participants feel comfortable um, and they don't feel like they're rushing into a dance class. After we're done seat with the seated exercises, we'll go um, to standing behind the chair using the chair as a bar um, just to slowly transition the standing and then um, we'll do some um, across the floor or um, center combinations, but people are always welcome to stay seated if they'd like. My favorite part of the classes are the pass the pulse at the end. Um, we get to thank everyone for taking class with us, um, and I love the sense of community that it shows, and it shows that we're all connected in some way for these classes. I have loved getting to know these people. Um, it's not um, a population of people that I expected to know coming to college. Um, so I've just liked getting to know them, hearing about their families, their kids, um, their stories from the past. I think dance is beneficial to a lot of different populations, but specifically for this one, um, the movements we're doing um, are helping with a lot of the symptoms that they um, have, such as bradykinesia um, and the trouble with coordination and balance. Um, and like some of the cross lateral movements we were doing, um, people say that that helps them tuck in their shirts in the mornings. Um, um, so just um, the movements that we're doing um, in the dance class are helping them also with their symptoms that Parkinson's bring. I would love to continue working um, with this program in some way after undergrad and I would love to keep teaching classes if that's a possibility as well.